Welcome to part three of the Exploded View of the Exacto Knife. Today we're going to be drawing the collet, which is this piece right here. Let's begin. Oh, by the way, this piece right here it is called the collar. I believe I called it the bushing last session, and that is incorrect. Called the collar. But let's go ahead and draw the collet now. And start with a ortho one, one eighth line, nine fifteenths, and with our tracking on, we can go ahead and match that up. This right here, that's going to help you out with your tracking. All right, now at the end here, there's a little piece that uh, is not threaded. Let's go ahead and offset that. Offset button. This is the 116. There we have it. Now let's go ahead and put a hatch inside here, this area. I'm going to go to the hatch tool. And we're looking for 31 right there. We have a scale of 0.25 and an angle of 0. Let's see what that looks like. That's not bad. In our original, I believe it's facing the other way, but I think I think I'm happy with that. Let's go ahead and leave it there. All right. So now, I'm going to go back to the line tool. We're going to make a three sixteenths inch line right there. Go ahead and grab the move tool. We're going to go ahead and put that right on the center. Perfect. On this top edge, I'm going to go ahead and do a 3 8 inch line, like that. Track that over like this, with the wand, of course. And there you have it. Now, it's going to need to come out. One fourth of an inch. Mark that off. This is a temporary line right here. Gonna need a vertical line of one fourth. Go ahead and use the move tool. Grab that right from the center. Put that on the end like that. Now, we go ahead and connect these lines like this. That'll give us the angle we need right there. Great. Let's go ahead and leave that temporary line. We don't need to get rid of that yet, and we might need it later on. All right, let's go ahead and put the front of this on. So, we need to go halfway the distance here. This is one-fourth. Half of that would be one-eighth. So let's go ahead and put a one-eighth inch line. Ortho on. There we go. <clears throat> now on the end here, vertical line of one eighth, just like that. Grab that from the center and put it right there. Go ahead and use the arc tool, three point arc, one, two, three. And we're going to go back in. We're just going to go ahead and bend that back down until it looks just the way we like it. Perfect. Let's go ahead and uh, mirror image that. Select it. Space bar. Quick point one. Quick point two. Do not erase 
source object. Fantastic. By the way, I've been saving all along, just to make sure nothing bad happens. All right, let's go ahead and grab the offset tool. We're going to put a distance in of 1 32nd, 1 over 32. Go ahead and offset that line in two directions. And we're going to go ahead and do the same right here. Hit escape. Get rid of these two lines right here for now. And let's go ahead and trim out that line and that line. And there we have it. Until the next session, have a great day.